Thanks for wearing the tinfoil hat, Orange. It makes me feel a lot more at ease knowing the government couldn't use our brainwaves to track us to this location. At ease. As you can see, Fruit Lovers, Lou the Tick is taking over today. I specifically requested the 78th episode. Why 78? Because it's where all the threads connect, man. 78, the number of cards in a typical tarot deck. 78, the atomic number of platinum. 78, the number of revolutions per minute of a gramophone. Tarot, gramophone, platinum, TGP. What's that an acronym for? Um, Tiny Gassy Poop? No! Orange, it's the Great Prophecy! The Great Prophecy? Oh, I've waited my whole life for the wonders of the Great Prophecy to be revealed to me! And it's finally going down today, in this episode! Can you sense it? Can you smell it? Um, not really. But then again, I don't have a nose. <laughs> Let's do this! Yeah! Hey Orange, can I ask you a question? Admittedly, I've never watched one of these episodes before, but I assume that's the deal, right? You ask questions, I answer them. No! Axe! Hey, Axe, he! Orange, we gotta get out of here! We're in danger! What do you mean? They're just trying to make an axe pun! Axe! Orange! Axe! Aliens for the extinction of Earth! Um, I think it just means axe. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! It's time for Ask Lou! What room can ghosts not go in? The living room! False! Unless said living room is protected by an ethereal energy net, ghosts can most certainly go in. Um, Lou? I think they were just making a joke. A joke? Yeah, fans like to submit funny jokes sometimes. Oh, I see. I'll try to keep that in mind. What's up? I'll tell you exactly what's up. Government overreach, UFO-related mortality rates, and covert CIA activity in the Balkans. Who is that? I just told you, like, moments ago. What is happening right now? Say hi, Hunter. Don't tell me what to do, Hunter. Say, I love you, Caden. I just met you, Caden. Can you turn Pear into a squirrel for the next 10 episodes? Once I accrue all seven of the Mystic Enigma Crystals, the answer will be yes. But since I only possess one Enigma Crystal as of yet, I can only turn Pear into a squirrel for about 10 seconds or so. Huh? Ah! Ah! I don't have much time! Uh, hey, Pear, what's your favorite ballet? Is it the Nutcracker? <laughs> have you heard about the new squirrel diet? It's just nuts! <laughs> How do squirrels remember where they buried their nuts? They use acorn nims! <laughs> How many squirrels does it take to... Aw, oh, man, I ran out of time! Oh, well, I think you got the nuts and bolts of it! <laughs> uh, Marshmallow is the cutest character on Ask Orange! I beg to differ! Obviously, you've never seen my Marshmallow cosplay. I'll be right back. Yeah! <coughs> Sorry, inhaled a fly. Drop every fruit on pear! Hey! Hey! Okay, well, this isn't so bad. <laughs> what the heck? Squash is not a fruit! I'm sorry to break it to you, amigo, but botanically speaking, squash have seeds and develop from the flower-producing portion of the plant. So keep them coming, fellas! But that's... Ow, crazy! If squashes are the fruits, then... Oh, that means... Ah! <laughs> can you speak different languages? Indeed I can! I'm Pluton Galactican, Universal Zid, Classic Radarnik, New Radarnik, Plutonic Neptunian, Quizit Thragnar, and Portuguese! Hey Lou, I'm a little scared of Little Apple. I see what kind of person you are. Let me guess, people like me bug you? <laughs> oh, did I do it? Did I properly do a humor? Yeah, that was pretty good. Oh, I love this whole humor thing. Okay, I'm ready for another joke. Let's do this. What do you call a fish with no eyes? <laughs> oh man, I can already tell this is gonna be hilarious. Let's see, a fish with no eyes. <laughs> oh, an eyeless fish. <laughs> oh man, I bet that's it. Eyeless fish, final answer. A fish. <laughs> oh, okay, well, yeah, very amusing. Although I feel mine was a bit better. What happens when a guy named Tim starts feeling cold? Okay, don't tell me. When Tim starts feeling cold, he probably... Uh, well, puts on a sweater! <laughs> oh, 
Oh, oh, that's totally it, isn't it? He says timber. Wow, I've only been doing comedy for a couple minutes and it is embarrassing how much better I already am at this than you guys. Hey, what does the cucumber say to the donut? Listen, this answer better make sense. Otherwise, I'm officially retired from comedy forever! Surprise airbag! What the heck is that supposed to- no! Hey, Pear! Hey! Airbag! No! Hey, what you yelling about? Oh, I thought I was gonna get launched up into the air. Oh, no, 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 no. See, you're thinking of surprise airbags. I'm just an airbag. Well, a delivery airbag. Ha, huh, what a relief. Yep, just came by to deliver this. It's a prophecy or something, I think. The great prophecy? Oh, give it here, give it here! Wow, eager much? Knife! Knife? We gotta get out of here before we get chopped! You're a sharp one, Pear! <laughs> no, 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 it's an acronym, see? Um, maybe we should just, you know, leave the area just to be safe? Nonsense! It's gonna be some epic prophecy about the end times, Armageddon stuff, fire and brimstone, you know? I don't know. This late in the episode, I really think it's gonna be a knife. Quiet! I've almost deciphered the message using my Enigma crystal. Okay, okay, got it. The great prophecy of K-N-I-F-E means knives now in fiery explosion! I told you there would be a knife! Yeah? Well, I told you it would be a fiery Armageddon! Hooray! Looks like you were both right! <laughs> 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 <laughs>